Hey Menard, sorry, what's up? I just caught your video and I just want to start out by saying I wanted to defend Candice Michelle. I'm a huge women's wrestling fan and I'm not in support of like that whole teenage bullshit. But like real, real women's wrestling. So I just want to say, okay, at first I didn't like Candice Michelle. Okay, yeah, she started out being one of those TNA girls, but when she's like when they finally shown like oh she finally shown that she wanted to actually be a wrestler then that's why I started taking notice of her. Now, it seems like, like Trish Stratus is now the modern day diva that all women in WWE try to be like now. Like she's the standard Trish Stratus. So, will Candice Michelle ever be like Trish Stratus? No, it never will happen. She's trying to be like her in you know, some ways, but it won't happen. But for me, Candice Michelle, yes, yeah, she has vastly improved big time. She took in baby steps but she has done a good job, I think, personally. You know, they gave her the title, like, really fast. I didn't agree with that. I felt like, okay, maybe she should have earned it more. But I still thought her title one wasn't that bad, you know? She has improved. And what pisses me off is when she got injured, like, none of the wrestling shooters on YouTube even talked about it. No one mentioned it. I'm like, when is the last time you've seen a female get injured like that on live television? that badly i mean it, it, she could have broke her neck but yet no one mentioned it like did it no one even give a damn about what happened to candace michelle and that pissed me off you know i see a girl who's trying to improve in the ring she's trying really hard to be a wrestler and people still don't want to give her that chance now with her getting injured i think that could be a good thing for her now because if she comes back people are going to really gather around her and be like okay this girl should be taken seriously she's for real she really wants this you know this would gain her a lot of uh, fans and i'm hoping it does you know there's a lot of haters out there i agree too with her, her former past you know people are going to hold her hold that against her and they shouldn't it's not fair but like as we all know many women got this double standard so i'm for one and like and my candace michelle fan i was not before in the past but now i grew to like her and I hope when she does come back from an injury that she comes back stronger than ever so she can really shut up these people because I think if she does come back and she does prove that she wants to be a wrestler, there shouldn't be no haters for her because that's a huge injury she just had and for someone like her who's not a trained wrestler to get that kind of injury and come back, that should shut people's mouths up. So I'm going to be in defense of Candice Michelle. I don't understand people's gripe with her. It, it, it pisses me off, you know. From how she came first came to WWE to how she left before her injury is a big, big major difference. And for people to not see that and recognize that, that's just crazy, you know? So I just wanted to make this quick video about that. I hope that she does come back soon and when she does, she's gonna shut up a lot of people. I really think she is because her wrestling skill has improved. She did a lot of great stuff with Beth Phoenix. And Beth Phoenix has really helped her out a lot. And so when she comes back, she's going to prove to everyone that she is a wrestler. That she really does want to wrestle. And that she wants to be the, the women's champion. And I hope the fans really rally around her because she deserves it. So that's what I wanted to say. And oh, about The Miz. Okay, I'm not really high on him yet. But he is trying to improve, you know. I, I, it's funny because I, I'm a huge big Real World fan. I used to watch, and I watched him as when he was on the Real World, and when he used to do his whole wrestling shtick and all that, I thought it was all fun and games. But you got to give this guy credit. He followed his dream. He wanted to be a pro wrestler for pretty much his whole entire life, and he followed his dream and he's done it. He's a wrestler in the WWE, and that says a lot. Not many people can go out there and follow their dreams and actually live their dream, and he's living his dream right now. So I give major props to the Miz. For that alone okay his wrestling skill is getting up there you know him getting teamed up now with, with John Morrison I think that's the help out the Miz so John Morrison is gonna help him out and whoever he fights in tag matches they're gonna help him out a lot he's gonna improve he's a great heel he got good mic skills he gets great reactions and that's what it, that's what it's all about getting the reactions from the fan people hate his guts he's doing his job as a heel so that's what I want that's what I want to say and um I agree with what you were saying, and I just hope these haters, these so-called haters, can really like shut their mouths and pay attention to what's been going on, especially with Candace Michelle. She deserves a lot of props, 
And I hope when she comes back from an injury, she's going to show everyone what kind of person she is and what kind of heart she has. And 